Before, when my asthma was very bad, I was afraid to go out kayaking by myself. There's nothing that stops me now. I do whatever I want. If I want to try something, I'm going to try it, and having severe asthma doesn't hold me back anymore. The greatest needs for people with severe asthma is to be properly diagnosed by specialists. And if the proper diagnosis is made early on, perhaps they won't go through the years of suffering that I did. inhaler because of asthma or another respiratory condition, tens of millions of Americans use metered dose inhaler. But studies show that an astonishing 70 to 90 percent of the time, inhalers are not used properly. So why is it so hard to get it right? Joining us to discuss is WSJ health reporter Sumathi Reddy. Hi Sumathi, great Hi, to, see great to see you. Um, studies have found that as little as 7 percent of the medicine is getting into your lungs when used right. improperly. You're using an inhaler perfectly, you're only getting probably about half of the medicine. So that's I'm just curious, when you have findings like this, can it all be chalked up to human error, or should the devices be redesigned? No, well, part of it is the device also. Okay. That's, a, that's a problem, too. Like I said, even if you're using it perfectly, you're only getting about 45 to 50 percent of the medicine. Right, right. So that is, that oh plays gosh. Well, business. look, if you're a medical device entrepreneur, it looks like there's room in this space <laughs> for some new inventions. All right, Sumathi, thank you so much for Thanks that. For